Hi, good morning, folks. It's Teresa again. Um, today is Wednesday. Woo, it's hump day. Woo, woo. No. <laughs> but anyway, um, I just want to, you know, wish everybody a blessed day. Um, and hopefully, you know, we have some blessings come our way, like as far as a job, money, um, you know, maybe we'll hear something good today about um, this new job bill, you know, and, and we'll be able to look forward to our retro, okay? I mean, I think our retro is, is more vital than just what was left in our account, you know, because the government left us hanging for five months and, you know, people lost everything, you know, and like, to me, you know, like... Like, I, I, I tried to get an incomplete with my uh, schoolwork, and the professor didn't give it to me. So, oh, because that's for a death in the family or some other kind of tragedy. Well, to me, I feel like losing my job and losing my financial stability is a death in the family. You know what I mean? Because it's, thing, it's, it's a death where, you know, you, you start to lose. Things start to die. And, you know, your, your spirit starts to die, and, you know... Your, your vision for your future kind of dwindles away. Um, you know, and you don't, you're, you're trying to see an end in sight, and you, you know, you, you're trying to walk through the clutter. You know, you're trying to walk through all these roadblocks and these barriers in your life. You know, things are being thrown at you like psh, boom, 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 like a nuclear war. You know, and uh, I think that is a death in the family. You know, but whatever. Um, you know, other people don't see that because they have a job. You know, they, they have some money coming in. They don't, they don't understand that they can make excuses and you're not, you know. Um, you know, but, like, I had to drop out of school because, you know, I, 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 I need my food stamps right now. Um, if I don't have a job, I need to feed myself. Um, you know, it's... Huh. I don't like saying that, you know what I mean? Because, like... I like to support myself. I like to pay my bills. I miss paying my bills. I miss looking at my credit, seeing it go up, to, uh, you know, to almost a 700, you know, to look at it now and it's, you know, the numbers are pretty much blowing apart your, you know, your, your shot for the future because now once, if, you know, if if we do get this retro, now I gotta build it back up. You know, and I'm hoping that a job comes along with it. You know, um, I'm trying not to lose hope because if I keep saying, "Oh, I'm gonna give up, I'm gonna give up," because it's not gonna block my blessing. You know, and I don't want to block my blessing. Um, you know, but anyway, you know, I'm just I'm just praying for our government to to really, you know, to have a heart and, you know, I know we have a you know. They have a tough job, you know, but like, you know, we got to stop, we got to stop looking at ourselves and think of the people, you know, that's what how the Constitution was written, it's we the people, not we the government, um, you know. What are you doing? Of course my dog's chewing my Bible, oh God, but anyway, um, <laughs> excuse me. But anyway, I'm going to send this out because I'm going to tweet this and, um, you know, rumor has it that, that Boehner's not going to entertain the retro, that he's against the retro. Well, you know, Mr. Boehner, we need our retro. You know what I'm saying? Um, if you were in our predicament, I'm sure you'd want your money too. So, um, you know, because that's one thing about me is I hate when people double talk themselves, you know, but if they were in this, like, you know, I know people that were in the same predicament as me, you know what I mean? But then they, they put me down, you know what I'm saying? But, and try to shoot my hopes, you know, but I, I know if they were in the same predicament as me, they'd want their money too. So, <laughs> money talks, you know what else walks. So, um, you know, but anyway, I don't want to have any more meltdowns. Um, you know, because I'm human, just like everybody else, you know, and, uh, you know, I, I want uh, our Facebook groups to all, you know, 
work together and try to pull together, you know, and not say because one person's not doing their job, maybe they don't have the means to do what, you know, what it is to do, you know, like make phone calls and, and do emails and do this and do that because they lost everything, you know what I mean? But we need to be the voice for other people that can't speak for themselves right now and, you know, um, put it out there. You know, I mean, there are a lot of people that are, you know, holding up the fort and, and, you know, speaking for other people, and I'm grateful for that, you know, because without them, we won't have a fight. You know what I mean? We won't have a voice. Um, I don't know, I just get emotional about it, but, you know, that's, that's okay. Um, you know, but, but we need our retro. We need this money. We need to get back on our feet. Um, you know, I guess, I guess my emotional is because I come from everybody else. Like, I feed off other people's energy, you know, as well as myself. You know, so I'm urging, I'm urging, I am urging Congress, I am urging Senate, and I am urging the Speaker of the House to do the right thing, as well as bring it to our President, okay? And I mean Mr. Obama to do the right thing, you know what I mean? Like, this is supposed to be the, the year change, the year we're going to walk through things, well, we need to walk through it right now, you know? Um, and with that, I'm going to yield the time. <laughs> you think I'm talking in... in, in you know, on C-SPAN. All right. <laughs> Talk to y'all later. God bless. Happy job hunting. And, um, you know, love y'all. Bye.